guys, good morning. It's 10 15. What are you doing? No, no. <laughs> I'm putting away some leftover breakfast. We had chorizo and egg, which was a delicious. Yeah. I had a light English muffin with some peanut butter and some grapes. Very wholesome, hearty breakfast. The only thing I was missing was like spinach or some sort of vegetable. It was really good. Autumn's walking around. We're about to go run a few errands. I've been texting my best friend Tara because you guys know that's the wedding that I'm going to in the Dominican Republic in October. And I, so I've been texting her about the dress and, and everything because I'm her matron of honor and I want to make sure, I told her, I was like, when's the last day we can get the dress because I'm trying really hard to lose weight. And she said, I have until July. So <laughs> I think that's pretty good till July. I think I'll be fine. The only problem is, is by the time I can get the dress, I have to wait. It'll take a little while to come in, but it, there's three months in between when I can get the dress, or the last day that I can get it, and the actual wedding. So, are you cleaning? Are you cleaning, Mama? Oh, okay, thank you. So I was telling her, I mean, three months is a long time. Like, I've only been doing this two months, and I've lost almost 25 pounds. And, I, of course, I realize the closer I get to my goal, the harder it'll be to lose it. But three months is a long time, so I'm going to have to be smart about whenever I go to get it. Luckily, it'll be, it won't, July is the cutoff, so it's not a big deal. I don't have to worry about it. But anyway, I was texting her that, and I saw Priscilla and her wife this morning. She came to pick up. You guys, if you live in the area and you want any of my junk, always just tell me <laughs> because literally when we get rid of things, like we're about to load it up, that's one of the errands we're going to do is to go drop it off somewhere because we don't want it here. I want to be, I want my garage back. So anytime you guys see something I'm getting rid of and you want it, let me know. We can either meet up or I can, if you pay shipping, I can ship it to you. I just don't want, I'm done with the junk in my house. I've said this before, I don't want to live. What are you doing? I have to be really careful with her and food that she's dropped on the floor or that's left over on her tray because she will come over here and get a snack from it later in the day. Excuse me. If I'm not careful, in fact, that's what she was doing this morning, trying to pick up her breakfast that she had this morning. But. I'm not trying to live a minimalistic lifestyle, but it would be nice to literally just have no, look at these curlies, to have no excess in the house, which makes it very difficult because we're a family of five and we have a ton of excess stuff. But just in general, I don't want to live with a bunch of extra. Yeah, I'll take one. So I'm trying one day at a time. It's very difficult. I'm not a pack rat, I'm not a hoarder. But I am sentimental, and I told you guys this yesterday, getting rid of stuff that I've had for a long time or that was of the girls, like, it's it's really hard. <laughs> so I'm trying. One day at a time. Anyway, we're about to leave. Let's go, Mama. You ready? <gasps> Let's go. Dada. Let's go. Good girl. Dada. Good girl, Mama. Yep, let's go. Good job, Autumn. Let's go. Say, hold on, Dad, let me open the door. Hold on. It's a beautiful day to be at Sam's. So, you guys, a couple of you, and Bea texted me two days ago and said that um, Sam's, well, she actually wasn't sure if it was Sam's or Costco, had new premier protein flavors, peaches and cream. No, yeah, peaches, peaches and cream, I think, and cookies and cream. So, we're out running errands anyway, and I was like, let's stop by and check it out. We were at Costco the other day, and I didn't see them, but I've heard they're delicious, so... That is what we're here for. <laughs> so, peaches and cream, Premier Protein, and cookies and cream. Super excited. I don't think we need anything else, but we have a Sam's membership. Might as well use it, right? Here we are. Getting a massage while we're at Sam's. <laughs> this one kind of hurts, too. I was just on this one. Look, that one has a uh, Sifu. Mm -hmm. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> You're welcome to have a seat, ma'am. Try it out. Oh, I was on that one. Oh, were you? <laughs> yeah. Okay. I actually want to try that high the back big one. Mm -hmm. one. Okay. 
Is that the Cadillac of That's massages? That's the Cadillac of them all. Yeah, because it does. It's the full chair. Um, one. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. Let's try this yeah. one. This is the massage chair. Mm -hmm. When you get a pedicure. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Okay, now if you want to stop it at a certain spot and isolate that muscle, just press the knead button. So if you find that sweet spot, just press that button real quick and it'll reverse and just stay right where it's at. And, and you can put them in a car? You can put it, they all go in a car, it's pretty cool. And they all have that adapter for the vehicle as well. Oh. Do y'all drive a lot? I was like, oh, this is caramel, but no, they're peaches. So it's peaches and cream. How? Well, that's because this is a 12 pack. The one at Costco is 18. Cookies and cream. And they're on sale for 12.66. That's a really great deal. That's only a dollar. A dollar and like four cents a piece. Five cents. Five and a half cents actually. <laughs> That's awesome. Limit how many? Three. Three per membership. Well, do you want to see if we like them first or you want to get a couple? When's the sale over? Because they're four dollars off, you guys. And they have. I wonder if they have strawberry. Oh, they have the strawberry in this one too. So I just bought a pack of chocolate. That's really disappointing, baby. I just bought a an 18 pack of chocolate at Costco. It was twenty five dollars. So for the same twenty five dollars, I could have got a twenty four pack. I should buy two of these and take the other ones back. Dang, you see that? We just bought the tw the 18 pack of chocolate, and for two for the same 25 bucks, I could have got a 24 pack of chocolate. Should buy these and take that one back. But then the gas and stuff, who knows? And then they have strawberry and the banana here. Cool. Ooh, I do. <laughs> oh, mama. Nope. Maybe the strawberry. 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 <laughs> Is that good? The strawberry's good. Yum. <laughs> no, 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 no pound cake. No. Oh, more for daddy, huh? <laughs> So we decided to pick up uh, two packages of the cookies and cream. So we got that one and that one. A pack of tortilla flax seed wraps. Um, some butter, they don't sell Kerrygold butter, butter here so we just got the pasture raised grass fed sea salt butter. And then one of the peaches and cream to try and then some milk for the girls. It's not cheaper here but it than the regular store but we're here and the girls need to milk so one whole one regular that's all we got we just dropped off andres and autumn at the house he was giving her a snack and then putting her down for a late nap which is not ideal i much prefer when she takes a nap during the day but she did have a nap while we were out she slept for like an hour and it just wasn't enough. She came home really grouchy, and so we're going to um, put her down for a nap and see if that helps her a little bit, not be so grouchy. And then I came to, ooh, little corgis. Yeah, I saw this video on Facebook of a corgi swimming, a, a dog. You know, they're the dogs that have kind of long bodies and short little legs, and they were swimming, and it was the cutest thing ever. Oh my gosh, it made me want a corgi. Anyway, totally sidetracked. I came to pick up Emmy from school, I'm sitting in carpool line, and it's Friday, so no homework, thank goodness. I really need to go through her books and stuff though, and make sure some of the books that she's been reading, because I let her read, or pick out the book that she's reading, and a lot of times the books that she checks out from the library are not age appropriate, like they're definitely younger, and that's totally fine because she's a really great reader she's already where she needs to be for third grade she surpassed it and so i allow her to read for fun all the time i mean that's she has options when she does fun activities in her room and if she's wanting to read a fun book cool but with her homework she's supposed to be reading things that are age appropriate that are and i don't mean when i say age appropriate i don't necessarily mean like 
they're not appropriate books but just that they're at her reading level that makes more sense or around her reading level she's supposed to be sticking with something that is where she's at in her reading and she doesn't always do that sometimes she picks easier books because she can get through them because she's not really the type of reader if she reads every day for 30 minutes she likes to be able to finish the book and a lot and the books she has at home are chapter books and she's not able to finish them in the 30 minutes and so sometimes she's like oh but I want to keep reading and then before you know it she's read for an hour and then she still has to do math and spelling and then we have dinner and she doesn't really get any like downtime after school so I kind of want to look through her books and maybe set up like a little reading schedule for her so that it's okay if she doesn't get through the book maybe she can do like three chapters and however long it takes her to do three chapters she can come back to it tomorrow so I kind of want to set that up for her and get her more used to it because when she gets into third grade the readings a little more stringent as far as how often she has to read and things like that so Maybe we can get used to it now. I don't know. Today was eh, pretty productive. We ran the few little errands that we had to do. We got that stuff from Sam's. But that's all about all we did all day. Um, I really didn't have much to do at home. I need to, I'm off tonight. I don't work at H&R, so I want to go ahead and start editing the vlog. Like when I get home, Autumn should be down for a nap. I wanna start editing the vlog just so tonight I don't have to worry about it and I can lay down and go to sleep early. And I'm scheduled to work tomorrow. There's a girl that messaged me that I work with and she's like, you want tomorrow off? I need the extra hours. And I'm like, hmm, do I? <laughs> I'm really contemplating because it would be nice. Emmy actually has two birthday parties tomorrow that we weren't going to get to go to because Andres has to work part of the day and we weren't going to get to go to them because I just don't have the time I was gonna be at work and I didn't wanna have, one of them is for a classmate and the other one is for Girl Scouts and so they fall right back to back. Like the one, her classmate is from two to six, I believe. And, oh, it's hot, she's wearing a jacket. Gosh, she must be hot. Um, but it's from two to six and then the next one's from 6.30 to 8.30. So I um, was kind of like, oh, uh, you keep, okay. Um, I was like, well, that's really backed as a, a huge part of the day. I don't know that I'm going to have time to take her. So literally right after I went to go get Emmy, I went to go get Maddie. And then one of our neighbors down the street had this basket, which is nasty. It definitely needs to be cleaned out. But, and it's kind of ragged, like the corners what and stuff. What is that? It's a basket. But the rest of it, I mean, it has good bones. So I think I'm going to hose it off and spray paint it and use it for something even if it's like in the garage for the balls or something i don't know i haven't decided yet but another man's trash is our treasure how about we put some like balls that that fit in there like or even shoes that would be a great thing for shoes we'll see Emmy took it upon herself to learn how to put in la oh good job mama thank you mommy and we Good know job. We okay, so it. on the soap, great. You got them in the right place. This one though, you can put a little bit more in. Okay, I just don't want to overfill. I it. know, but this is a really big load, so you can put it. You know, you see how it says max? Can you see it? Mm -hmm. Oui. It's okay. It's okay. Push. There you go. You see how it's like hitting the max sign? Mm -hmm. That's good. Okay. Good job. Well, if it's dripping down, it's okay because well, it's going to be on it anyway, right, It mommy? is, but that's fine. Here, we'll just take a, p a clothing. That's the best idea. And wipe it off. It's not a big deal. Cool. It's a really large load. Good job. Can you put this up there, mommy? Yeah. Because I will. And then when you turn it on, you have to hold down that button just like the dryer. So for you, I'll let's do cold wash. So Turn it. One more. There you go. And then you have to hold this one to start it. And then it'll start. Yay. Awesome. Yay. Now you can do laundry every day. I haven't tried. Oh, yeah. I'll do it every day. <laughs> oh well, you're not eight years old. 
You want to do it? Next time you can do it. The more people who do laundry, the less mommy has to do. <laughs> Woo! And the more you have to worry about Look at things. Me. And, the, and the less you have to worry about doing other things. Yeah, that's how it works for mommy. So it's just me and the girls tonight for dinner and I didn't feel like cooking. So we had hot dogs in the fridge. They're gonna have hot dogs. I had about like a third of a bag of seasoned fries. You do. I knew they'd love it. They're going to have fries and hot dogs. And I don't have any buns, so I'm going to put them on regular bread. Oh, careful, Mama. Give to Mommy. Thank you. Go play over there, please. And so, yeah, I'm going to have a protein shake with some peanut butter because I don't really, I had kind of a late lunch and I don't really feel like eating. And I really didn't have a chance. I've kind of been lazy since we got home. I didn't have a chance to edit, so I need to go upstairs and edit. And everyone will kind of have an early bedtime tonight because I'm going to have an early bedtime tonight. Look at that curl. That's so strange. Does it have something in it? I don't know. They're Anyway, they're hungry. They're bothering me for food, so I'm like, okay, I've got the fries going. Heating up the hot dogs. I'm going to have them eat. We'll go upstairs. Straighten up a little bit, and then literally, we're going to bed. I don't care if it's Friday night or not. Mommy's tired. Adam. Adam. Hey. Hey. Hello. There we go. Say good night. See you tomorrow. Boop. <laughs> good night. See you tomorrow. Good job. You're so smart. You learn so quick. Careful. Me too. Good night, see you tomorrow. Good night, see you tomorrow. I'm seeing it too. Bye, bye, bye. Good night, see you tomorrow. Adam. Adam. Good night, see you tomorrow. Adam. Say bye. Good night, see you tomorrow. Night, night. Came to check on Maddie. She was. Supposed to be hanging her clothes. She did good. So far, so good. About halfway done. She still has some stuff to do. But she stepped on a Lego after I told her to put her Legos away. And she cut the bottom of her foot. And, I, and it was with a Lego. But let me show you which kind of Lego it is. And see, that's why we always listen, right? Yeah. Because mommy it. knows best. Yeah, and I got it a pointy thing. Mm, like she legit cut her foot. And but but I can't find my skin of the bottom of it. So I got well, baby, it. I doubt your skin is somewhere laying on the floor here. Put all your Legos away. Fix your animals. That way we can finish up your clothes. Come on, you did good so far, but you still have some more to do. It's like blood. That is a little one. Oh, yeah. I need a little band aid. Yeah. Currently hanging, folding clothes, and I'm purging again. Just adding to my pile. All these gone. Nice. Did Daddy do that? No, he 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 oh. he does help me. Oh, that's Autumn's. Yeah. Really. Cool. Great job. Fix your animals, okay? Room's looking good. Emmy's going potty, but she's helping. Her room's clean, so she's helping me sort clothes. Lord. But this whole thing, I should have saw, showed you the before, this entire thing was full of laundry. And now, this is all we got left. And I'm organizing the closet.
Okay, I think I got it pretty cleaned out. I moved a little a few Hello Kitties I'm keeping up here and then behind it I just have more oh, obviously it needs to be dusted more um, Forever 21 leggings that I haven't opened up yet and then there's some jewelry cases back there that if we ever move to another house I want to keep it so that I can rearrange this a little bit differently um, I have boots I went through my bags and condensed all of them I got rid of a ton actually I condensed them down into here and really or realistically at the end of the summer if I don't end up using some of these they're going to go I do want to use this one I haven't used this one yet and these little like coin pouches and stuff and this backpack I bought last year and never used it so I want to use some of these bags this year but one big thing that I did was Maddie what are you doing awake I need to go oh so this hook I've had since I, I mean, was a, a kid. It was in our bathroom. We used to hang it, um, hang towels on it. And funny thing, this has a little, like, chip in it. So I put this bubble sticker over it. Literally, I've had this since probably 15, 18 years since I was a teenager. And on this side, I had a bunch of, like, crossbody bags, and I got rid of almost all of them. I kept two, a black and a brown, no, and a gray, and I put my Michael Kors purse up there, and that was that. Everything else went, so now it's a little more streamlined here. It doesn't stick out as far, and uh, I need a bigger closet. <laughs> That's all there is to it or I need to get rid of clothes, but you guys have gotten rid of so much literally like this is all the clothing that I have Which is still a lot for people that don't have a lot of clothing, but I got rid of so much But yeah, it's clean the floor and everything is looking good looks a lot better than it did So let me show you what I got rid of so that is the pile of stuff that I got rid of all these bags that I just don't need all the hello kitties I mean mounds and mounds of clothes like all of this is my clothes everything that I got rid of I mean even stuff that I just recently wore the other day night night baby love you go to bed she always uh, wants to get up for everything <laughs> um yeah things that I just I've worn recently but that I wasn't comfortable in didn't fit right I'm not going to worry about losing weight and waiting for it to fit right if it doesn't fit right now I pretty much got rid of it or if I don't feel like it'll fit in the next like 20 pounds. <laughs> I'm just, I'm done. I got rid of it. So all this, even though we just made a donation station today, literally all of this is going to go again, which feels great. So I never did have that girl pick up my shift because I was like, you know what? I need to go to work <laughs> at least tomorrow. And the rest works. My mom's going to have the girls. So I was like, what am I going to do? Sit here and not have her watch the girls and watch them myself. So I was like, no, I'll just go to work. So I'm going to export the vlog. It's about 8.20 and then head to bed. I'm tired. I've had an eventful day. Lots of errands and things to go. Uh, and we did and I'm just tired. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. I will let you guys go here. Even though it's kind of early. Like I said, I just want to kind of try and get an early set to the night. And hopefully I've exhausted myself enough. Because the last two hours we've been rotating laundry folding hanging up laundry and organizing the closet but it feels really good my next project i think is going to be to tackle the office everything looks neat and organized but i just have too much stuff just too much so i'm going to purge a lot of my like planner things stickers i don't even know what else like this all right here is pretty much just junk my pins i'm just going to try and purge a little bit and clean up this area and get things going so that'll be my next project throughout next week so hopefully you guys enjoyed watching like i said and we will see you bright and early tomorrow